Even if he was to have like maybe three or four wives, uh, three or four wives, and you know the the wife gets suspicious or jealous, um, how does he actually help with this? When the Quran limited the number of plural wives, because before Islam it was unlimited. In any religion before Islam it was, it was unlimited, and neither the Bible nor the Torah have ever addressed this matter. It was only the Quran which limited the number. But Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says. So he, yes, he said one or two or three or four, but in case that you are, you're afraid or you assume that you're not going to be fair in treating them fairly as far as time and spending, then one is enough mm. and you should stick to one. Mm. So the fairness in dealing with the co-wives is concerning the time that you spend with them, the money that you spend on them, everyone based on their needs this one have kids this one doesn't have based on their needs but when it comes to love affection and emotions no one has any control over that mm. you know what even with your own kids you may like one of them more than the others mm. right yes. why because of so many reasons love is in the heart so sometimes without a reason you like uh, you have Maryam you have Sarah you have uh, Anas you have but you like Anas more than anybody else or you like Sarah more than anybody else or because one of them is the youngest or one of them is a, they, they exchange the same feeling with you so you cannot actually control the emotions when it comes to whom do you love more as long as when it comes to the treatment you're fair mm -hmm. so that is perfectly okay 